So I gotta start by saying the game is named Conjury. You guys can read. But don't lie. The music go kind of crazy. I'm a big fan. And I like pixel graphics and stuff, but this is basically, if I understand, like a Slay the Spire, but with, um, none among us remember the day that guy turned black. The memory of that fateful event has dissolved into the obscurity of time, erased by the wicked entities of Lutham Woods. Creatures born of nightmarish imagination now torment humanity, ceaselessly pouring out from behind the twisted trees. With every fall that took me close to the forest edge, my hands tremble, for the words that were promised to my kind echo through my ears. Hanging from a chain around my neck was a small ornate key. It was the mark of a key bearer. I alone have been chosen to venture in the forest and find the source of its wickedness. Maybe if they sent more people, they'd have better success. Okay, so we got 20 HP. And it's got controller support. You rarely see that. It's slime time. Why do you say it's slime time? Why can the slime speak? Select the card to play. Each card has a mana cost in the top corner. Cool. I know how to read. Let's go. Put me in. We jab at him. We jab at him. We jab at him. You feeling me? They drop stuff. We got it. Ooh! Attack to durability. Unequip. Double this weapon's attack. Whoa! Attack. When attack and take one damage, I guess this is to get like a fast ability because it's only one. Attack six. While this is equipped, you can't draw cards. Uh, I think I'll grab this one. Okay, so stuff disappears when you... Let's draw a card. It looks like you can draw as long as you have mana left over. Block two damage. First. I guess... What do we do here? If I use two parries... Oh, you gotta parry specific, you gotta choose your pairing. I can just choose to get hit, right? To put my weapon on the board. Because I don't know how long they'll have us fighting. And yeah, it looks like you can use a weapon for a bit. Let's go ahead and... Unequip double its attack? I get it. So whatever attack it has, it'll get double. I don't know why I assumed that meant every time I equipped it thereafter. Oh, that's good. Okay, that's the end of my turn. So you draw one every turn. So we can finish him off like that. Can I draw a card? That's another jab. First, let's see what's in the bag. Give a weapon three attack. Deal two damage. And unlock any overload mana slots. Interesting. Gain two mana. You cannot draw a card next turn. That'll let you burn out, basically. But I think we'll do this. Does it have to be something I already have on the board? It'd be nice if I... Let me see. I could just basically fill this out right, actually. Right? Carry that. See what he got for me. An apple? Your all stats effects can only be used once. Give all cards plus two damage can only be used once. I think we'll keep the apple. I don't know how many, what they mean by can only be used once. They might be once per combat. Let's go ahead and double parry here. It looks like we can get overrun. Um, let's draw. It looks like we can overrun because there's okay, no more. I, there were three enemies earlier. Can I? Can I double? It has to be on the field. They lucky boy. They need to give me something that'll let me double what's in my hand. So we'll go ahead and attack you, attack you, and then we'll just get hit. You have unopened loot bags. Oh, they disappear if you don't open them. Okay, my bad. Draw cards until there are four in your hand. Okay, that's for burning out. 
Give weapon three damage for this turn only. Deal four damage. Four damage for two mana. Looks like this looks normal. Three damage for this turn only. But it only costs one mana, but then I have to have a weapon in here. I think I'll do that. I think I'll try and play around the weapons because there are two weapon slots. Yeah, I, this is like a weapon building game, it looks like. This enemy intends to attack you. Oh, wait. I guess we'll just get hit. This is what it is. That's what I said earlier, right? Give a weapon three attack. Two mana. Give a weapon three attack for one mana. And now we can one shot. Oh boy. Now what else do we have here? Oh, let's see what he's got for me. Go outside this. Can only be used once. Restore 10 health and become poisoned. So all cards, the cost of everything to one? How many cards can I hold? Well, we can parry him. Let's actually get to attacking him because you gain a card every turn. I don't want to be sitting around getting overrun. Well, we don't have enough. Okay, well, at least now we can live, but I think I'd rather get hit. Yeah, I'd rather just get hit. Let's go ahead and give it a second. Let's see. Oh, we got the weapon back. Um. Let's see what we got. Let's go ahead and put our weapon in hand. And then that's four. There's a jab. And I guess I could have used the radish. But I don't know if I get to keep it. Oh, that's the exit. That means I can leave now, but why do I do that? I have an apple. And now we can keep the extra items. Let's see. Look at the top three cards in your deck. Pick one to draw. Can only be used once. Draw a card reduce cost by once. Is that forever? Don't put your hand to your deck. So I could burn out and then for free, I can draw four basically. Okay, so that's the maximum of cards. Three, six, seven. Cool. Let's go and exit. Escaped. What do you mean escaped? I beat them. Boy, what the heck? Okay. Um... I don't know what these locations are. <laughs> view inventory, view deck, status effects. Oh, this tells you how the status effects work. I don't want to go to the shop because I know I'm broke. You place a weapon upon the altar to receive an upgrade. Let's go! Let's go! What's the upgrade? They now cost less. Let's go! Oh, that costs 10? If I had more bread, I could do it again? How do I keep it? I want this. Thank you. I better have the card. Enemies may have special effects when they attack you. If their attack is zero, the effect is negated. Okay, so if you entirely block something, then you're straight. They may also have an effect when attacking or being attacked. Okay. Now, here's what's good. This will add a random plus one cost to a random card in your hand if she hits you. Okay, so smash or pass on the bunny. I'm kidding. But now that this costs two, I get to put this on no matter what. I could just parry her. Or I could just one-shot him. He said smash. I'm gonna one-shot it actually. And then draw. And pick up whatever the loot is. Another weapon! Attack three. Heal two when attacking? Boy! After you take damage, gain plus one attack? Hmm. 
Interesting. Plus two attack if you have another side. So if you have them dual equipped, then it's four attack with three durability. That's pretty good. Um, I think I'll take the Soul Blade. I think. I think. I feel like damage will eventually become unavoidable. And this just cost one less mana. Now the question is, when damage becomes unavoidable, do I want to be trying to scramble to heal? What does this Y button do? What does that mean? Do I want to be scrambling to heal or do I want to be just doing a little more damage because I'm going to get hit anyway? That's the real question, right? Um, I think I'll go for... I think I'll... I think I'll just go for more power and, and opt to like block, right? That's what I think I'll do. What is this? Okay, they summon two dudes. What do you do? This enemy's attack will increase by two each turn. That's a joke. Um, this attack will prevent you from drawing a card. Okay, now we got two weapons. Can I, can I dual swing or something? Well, I get to jab him. I'd rather... Well, I guess I don't have to... Let's see. We'll jab him. Finish him. Because we can't have him scaling on us, right? We'll draw a card. No, we won't draw a card. Let's see what you got for me. Block three damage. Cost one less for any damage taken. Wow! I don't... Oh, I guess if I can hit myself, maybe? I don't know. Draw until there are four cards in your hand. Block two damage. After if after the enemy's attack is zero, deal two damage. Oh yeah. Cooking. Wait, then do no damage. Oh, it's because it's three. Overkill by accident. What is that? This will disable the card draw button. Well, let's jab him, I guess. The music going, though. Another jab. Let's see what you got for me. Deal eight damage. Cost one less for every... That's a whole bunch of stuff for getting hit. Deal damage and fifth poison? I don't know what that does. Oh, that's to see the board in case I want something for now. Draw two cards immediately? I feel like drawing cards would be good, but... Damage is damage, huh? And looking at how the HP is ramping up on the enemies... There may be a point where I no longer have the choice. Let's fully block him, right? And swing. And I guess our card's gone. We'll inflict burn. Wait, I didn't remember seeing the burn. Whenever you draw a card, take a damage. Um, poison, you will take one damage. Puzzle, draw a card, okay. So I got six damage in my pocket. It looks like the best healing is to not get hit for real. Deal eight damage to all enemies, cost the same as your health total. So all the costs 20 health, I guess it's good if you're low. This probably goes crazy. Look at the top three in your deck, pick one if you choose a fish. I don't have any fish like that. Deal one damage, draw a card. Well, I guess I can end up with fish, right? But I bet there are different classes or something. And there's probably like a, a fish based class or something weird. What was it? This is three damage. Um, first, we want to block and we want to draw, actually. Yeah, that way we can be getting into our deck. What are you going to do? Heal its allies? Don't care if you heal people. Unless you're gonna hit me too, I'm not gonna be able to do what I want to do. I think I'm just gonna get hit this turn. Because looking at it, right? These are both two. And I can only block for two. And I gotta put this on, right? Oh wait, there's four. I forgot there's four. But even if I give this three attack, I'll only be able to one shot one of them. If I had a second parry, then I'd be good, but I don't. So we're going to sharpen him since we have two hits. And we're going to get rid of the burn, I guess, so we don't take damage. Extra damage beyond the three. What do you got for me? 
A banana gained two mana this turn. That's still not enough to, to do it. Become invincible for one turn? All my food from last time disappeared, right? Let's go ahead and just not get hit. Okay, Courage, give another three damage. So I can one-shot old boy with eight HP out there. That's a no-brainer. You're finished. Because he gets two to every turn. So even if, let's say I one-shot her instead, right? Nah. It's just better than one shot do with more HP. Let's go and use Dig on her. A Cripple Katana? That's another three damage. Three... Five, we'd still be short. Do I draw? In hopes of finding another parry? I don't know if I'll use it anyway. I guess we're just getting hit. I don't want to get hit that hard though. Do you always talk about 20 HP? Or di didn't I heal myself the last one? That's in our turn. Even though we have access to the exit to leave, I'd much prefer to finish what I started. That's two, that's five. There we go. We like to pick up all the loot. Add two random action cards to your hand. Draw three and take three. Deal five, cost one less for each weapon equipped. All of these are pretty funny. Knowing that I'll get five damage, but I like to play with RNG. I won't lie to you. Anytime I see RNG, I'm pretty hyped. Uh, that's a shop, but I think we're broke. I think 18 gold is broke. But I guess we should look at the shop, right? Just because it's for the um, purpose of the thing. But you see, I'm broke. Normally, I wouldn't do this, but just because I'm recording, just so you guys can see the shape of the shop, right? Normally, I'd never go somewhere at the on the first rotation of seeing a shop i'll never go normally now what does this do well in your inventory every time you damage enemies you'll can you can use it one max mana if you start a turn with five or less health gain a mana oh wait they have flavor text too yeah this is good yeah, this is good. And card removal, that's also 20. Yeah, we was broke. Now let's go ahead and see what's going on here. Boss battle. Bosses are tougher than normal enemies. The king of boss will end the battle and cause other enemies to disappear. Okay. They'll also reward you with a special item. Okay. What you about? 36, troll. Wait a minute. There we go. You have a weapon 3 attack? I think it's... Oh, no, man. Should I just try and burst him? I think I should. I think I should just trade blows with him. Because I bet I heal at the end. What are you doing? The attack will remove one durability from weapons. Yo, yo. He will need to rest after his powerful attack. It doesn't matter. That doesn't matter. That doesn't matter. Cause I'm low-key, I'm about to just... I'm gonna parry this. I'm gonna put this on. I'm gonna poison him. And we for real just gonna do just what I said too. We're just gonna attack him. Right? We're for real just gonna attack him. We're just gonna attack the dude in the middle. Right? Like. <laughs> oh, 13's actually way more than I thought. Block three damage. Block four damage. Shoot. Is he hitting harder this turn? Wait, do all enemies just hit harder? Hey, yo. Oh boy, I might need to get sunned very quick, actually. I guess while we're here. We just 
They still drop items, boy. Why didn't I think of that? That's an extra, what you call it? That's an extra. Draw three cards, we're gonna need this, I think. Even though it's two mana. Well, since he's resting. I don't wanna have mana left over. Uh, I'm gonna end with the mana left over. You still have a lot of mana left over. You can draw a card at any time for one mana. You can have seven. I know what I'm doing. It was to reduce the cost of this. Behind every disaster, there's a goblin grin. Yo, old boy is hitting hard as heck. I didn't realize how much five health was when you have 20, dude. That's 25%. Will he have to rest afterwards again? Yeah. Okay, um, four. So we can still knock old boy, right? So let's knock old boy first, pick up his loot. Deal two damage, take one damage for zero. Give weapon three attack, this is gonna be useful. Now we're gonna block you. We're gonna block you. Oh, does the poison just last forever? Yo, poison is about it. Okay, that's only four. Now that's good. We're gonna draw three cards. We got shafted on the card draw. But at least we can double parry and be safe since he's gonna take one damage anyway. Now we drop in spiders. Courage? I need a weapon, dude! I'm running around with a whole bunch of weapon attack stuff. Huh? Nah. What is this? Block two damage? We have to do this. I'm sick. I'm sick. Oh, oh he's shunting me. 8 HP, there goes a weapon. Okay, now he's resting this turn. Right? Now he's gonna stop. What is that? To prevent you from drawing next turn? It doesn't matter. Because... We're gonna equip this. We're gonna give this three more attack. And then we'll be running around with the real weapon. Let's go ahead and end the turn. We're gonna take a little damage, that's cool, it gets more. And now we'll be able to start one shot and stuff. Okay, so he's gonna be, what is that, six? <gasps> I only have six HP, am I dead? I'm dead. Bro, I'm dead. Okay, we got some parry. I'm still dead. No, bro, I'm dead. I'm dead as heck. There's no. Oh, I'm dead. The extra enemy was was too much. I think the the only thing I can say to myself is, okay, you know what we'll do. First, we're gonna attack this guy on the side. Apple gives me eight health. Okay. Now we're not dead. RNG, RNG. Um, now that we're not dead, we're gonna. Do do we parry here, or do we use our two mana this turn to put ten attack on this thing? Well, he has to rest next turn. We straight. And now we got nine damage right here. We got two jabs for old boy. Cool. Now let me see what you got for me. Is that all cost of all cards in hands to one? That's pretty good. Add random equipment card to your hand. It costs one. Can only be used once. What's equipment? Is that weapons? Shuffle? Yeah, you deck? Yeah, we're about to go ham on him next turn. We're going to get the weapon now. Okay. Now, what is this? Nine? You finished.
Ah, ah. Okay. And now we got stuff. While in your inventory, start each battle with a banana in your hand. Look at that. I don't even know what a banana does. Level two. Ah, oh, it gave us our HP back. Do we get our HP back whenever we come out, or is that because we finished the boss one? A banana gained two mana. Wow, so you can just start off with two mana. That's all I can see. Well, we just one shot that. But most importantly, let me go ahead and add something to my deck. Block three, two durability. Wow. What is this about fish? Attack two durability. Three when attacking. Durability three when attacking, take one damage. Ew. If you defeat an enemy, draw a card. Wow. Now, um. What I do want to say is, you guys kind of get the gist of what we're looking at. So that kind of marks the end for the video. See you guys soon.